New tonight, restrictions easing up a bit in St. Louis County. Just hours ago, County Executive Dr. Sam Page announced he's allowing restaurants, bars, and banquets to be open a little longer starting tomorrow. News 4's Emma Hogue is live from Kruger's Bar in Clayton with details. Emma, it's welcome news for business owners. Yeah, Lauren, a lot of employees really excited about this announcement. Right now, the curfew for bars and restaurants in St. Louis County is 10 o'clock, but starting tomorrow, that gets extended an extra hour to 11 p.m. And for some, that extra hour means a really big boost in sales. A lot of people, particularly young people, they're not ready to go home at 10 o'clock. And it's not like they're down here binge drinking, but they would like to sit and relax and socialize with their friends. They don't want the party to end at 10 o'clock. I don't think anybody does. So 11 is a step in the right direction. So again, that 11 p.m. curfew takes effect tomorrow and impacts restaurants, bars, and banquets where indoor dining is already at 25% capacity. In a pre-pandemic year, Kruger's typically closes at 1 a.m. And at a bar, employees here say every hour counts. A reminder, St. Louis City has had an 11 p.m. curfew for a few months now, and St. Charles County got rid of their curfew altogether earlier this month. Dr. Sam Page says this decision made sense since coronavirus cases have been slowly declining since mid-November, and we've had an increase in vaccine distribution. He says he's been in talks with the Restaurant Advisory Board and understands these owners need more hours to stay open. The owner of Napoli, also in Clayton, expects this extra hour to be a big step forward. 10 o'clock was not the right time to make the curfew. Um, it's, it's way too early for people to come in and dine at 8 o'clock reservation, 8.30 reservation, and have a good dining experience. And then we've got to drop a check at 9.45 and they have got to be out the door by 10. So this hour push is going to be huge for us and we're really excited about it. So still no word on when capacity might be bumped up to 50%, but I did talk to one other restaurant owner who says this extra hour really won't help him much at the end of the day. I'll have more from him coming up tonight on News 4 at 10. For now, reporting live in Clayton, Emma Hogue, News 4.